This is day 71, Coffee with Kenny, and I'm really bummed Netflix canceled The Punisher Season 3. Uh. Today, pursue your passion. Is your passion to be a safe and prudent helicopter pilot? Then you should be avoiding selling with power, power settling, vortex ring state, whatever you want to call it. Let's just talk about that situation where you settle in your downwash, and if you're close to the ground, this could be an accident, even a fatal accident. Why is it doing that? I'm Kenny Keller, creator of Helicopter Land Ground School, and let's do a review first, how to stay out of it. Today I wanna to cover the general safe rule for flying your helicopter approach. And this is a general rule, it's not anything in a reg anywhere, and it's kind of conservative, but that's okay. In order to keep yourself out of settling with power, always keep a minimum of 30 on your airspeed until your rate of descent is below 300 feet per minute. If you follow this, you will not get into selling with power. It just plain won't happen. If you have all three of these flight situations together, this can cause you to get into selling with power. Take away any one of those three and you're not in it. So let's break these three down just a little bit. Rate of descent, 300 feet per minute or greater. If you are at 300 or higher on your VSI as you're flying your approach, that's number one. Using 20 to 100% of available power, meaning you are using power. You're not in auto rotation, you are using available power. Airspeed less than ETL, effective translational lift. Remember that ETL occurs somewhere between 16 to 24 knots. So if you're at 30 or above, Again, you're not in that zone. So there is a little bit of fudge factor figured in there, but that's to keep you safe. So remember, if you always keep 30 on your airspeed until your rate of ascent is below 300 feet per minute, you will not get into selling with power. Hey, don't go away just yet. You wanna take our training for a 24 hour test drive? There's a link below this video. You can click that, enter your name and email to get access to our training site for 24 hours and take a look firsthand. Avoid it. Power settling, selling with power, vortex ring state, you can go down in the comments if you want to argue over that one. Uh, we're going to cover that in an upcoming webinar with Taz Christman, 2018 Flight Instructor of the Year, where he's going to talk about the differences between countries and the differences between what people call it. But let's just stick, uh, if you want to argue in the comments, go ahead. I'm not going to get on that argument since we've got that webinar coming up soon. What I just really wanted to hone today was avoid it. Understand that if you use the general safe rule for flying approaches, Always keep 30 on your airspeed until your rate of descent is below 300. It's never going to happen to you. And yes, there's a little bit of a fudge factor built in there with that, but that's why you call it a fudge factor, right? It's a method that you can use to always make sure that you're safe. And the number three comes up so many times in training. I was thinking this morning, you know, I did that series of videos, the helicopter threes, seven years ago now, over seven years ago. I'm thinking maybe we should reshoot those. I've had people actually ask about that. Avoid selling with power. Use the general safe rule for flying approaches. Always keep 30 on your airspeed until your rate of descent is below 300 feet per minute and you will not get in with selling with power. We've talked about it in a lot in the past. Just a week or so ago, I did a video on the Bouchard recovery, which I've just started kind of monkeying with and that you should learn as a pilot today. You should know the way the FAA has taught us for years, but the Bouchard method is, a, is also a very popular method to use and that can be utilized in, at times where maybe the traditional method may not help you. So understanding what it is, but avoiding it is key and also knowing what to do if you get in this situation. I will tell you, my examiner of many years I've heard him say it over and over again. As a helicopter pilot today, one thing that's gonna bite you in the ass is selling with power. If you don't understand it and you don't know how to avoid it or if you don't know how to get out of it. So let's agree on that one, right? Let's agree on there is a problem when flying a helicopter where you could settle in your own downwash and it could get you in a dangerous situation and could be an accident, even a fatal accident. You know, as pilots, we need to review, not just learn something one time and then move on. So I thought, you know what, today, since things have settled down after the big sell, I thought, 
let's cut let's uh cut let's cover selling the power again vortex ring state whatever you want to call it let's revisit it today it's been a wild two weeks man this big the big celebration ended last night and this month with the seven year celebration and my birthday and heli expo it has been wild crazy i'm kind of wore out and it's and it's a good wore out right it's fun coffee with kenny's been amazing but i feel good that the kind of the pressure's off and now we can get back to the daily business and get back to the morning video videos in the kitchen i've done some remotely at the airport and on the road recently is because the things have been crazy but i really just uh i really like these morning especially on a day like today because this is saturday saturday is my favorite day of the week hope you have a great saturday hope you have a great weekend thank you for everyone for all the wonderful feedback and comments the seven year celebration has been awesome please subscribe to our channel and click the button so you can be notified each day when we do our daily video and of course of other things that may be uh coming up in the future so do us a huge favor, like, subscribe, and we will see you in the next video.